This will be a quick demonstration of uh, breaking and joining 2D geometry. Um, the specific case was for a, uh, a plasma cutter, but it doesn't really matter. It's, it's uh, pretty basic stuff. I'm just going to throw some shapes out here, and it can be very complex stuff. It doesn't uh, necessarily have to be simple things like I'm going to do. We'll throw a couple of circles and, oh, I don't know, an ellipse. There. And some uh, some rectangles. Don't sketch. All right. So here you have a bunch of shapes that you uh, have got overlapped, but what you want to do is make them all into one big shape. The quickest way to do this that I know of is to use the break mini function. You can just window pick everything, hit the space bar, click OK to confirm it. And what that does is uh, what was originally, go into select mode here, uh, what was originally a full line you can see is now broken at every intersection. And that's true of everything that was selected and thus everything in this uh, particular case. And the next thing that uh, will come in pretty handy is the quick trim function. Go into the trim menu, drag, drag grab quick trim, and it will basically let you just start pointing at stuff you no longer need, and every time you click it, it goes away. And it'll highlight the uh, the parts that it's, that it's uh, wanted to get rid of. Sometimes you want to zoom more than I just did there. But as you can see, it's a really straightforward process, and it doesn't matter the complexity of the shape. It could, you know, I could be, uh, you know, have a drawing of a, uh, a barn and a goat on top of the barn, and you know, a, a tractor parked next to the barn. As long as they all overlap, this will work uh, exactly the same way on all of those. Uh, anyway, hope that helps.